I'm going to show you how to get the correlation coefficient using the TI-84. I'm working with my tattoos and teeth data and I've already inputted it into the calculator in list one and list two. So again, to input data into the calculator, you want to click on your stat menu and press enter. All right, so for example, the first person that was surveyed had nine tattoos and 20 teeth. The next person had one tattoo and 30 teeth and so on. So these are actually ordered pairs. And I want to find if there is a correlation between tattoos and teeth. So there's a couple ways to do that. The first way is to press your stat menu, right arrow over to calc, and scroll down to linear regression AX plus B. It's also down here under linear regression A plus BX, which is a little redundant. Remember, if you're looking at the equation of a line, the number that's being multiplied by X is your slope. All right, so I'm going to scroll down or select option four. And I need to tell it what two lists I need to correlate. So it defaults to my X list as L1, which was correct, and my Y list, which was the number of teeth. I put that in list two, and that's correct. And I'm gonna scroll down to calculate. Now you'll see in this original output that it's not giving R. So to do that, and you only have to do this one time unless you reset the memory on your calculator. What you need to do is you need to go to your catalog menu, which is right above your uh, zero key, and it's a second key. And you want to scroll down until you find diagnostic on. Honestly, I have no idea why it doesn't default to showing R. So scrolling down, hopefully not going past it, you want to find diagnostic, specifically diagnostic on. Here it is. All right, so diagnostic on, press enter, and enter again, and it'll say done. So if I go back to my stat menu, right arrow over to calc, select option four again, and enter all the way down to calculate. Now you'll see the output has R, which was negative 0.92. That indicates a strong negative linear relationship or a strong negative correlation between tattoos and teeth. In other words, as the number of tattoos increases, the number of teeth decreases. And um, some other pieces of information that we will use a bit later. The other way to get R from your calculator is if you go to your stat menu, right arrow over to tests. Now these are all the hypothesis tests that the calculator has built in. And at this point in our course, we haven't covered that yet, but there is this linear regression t-test that will also give you the output of the correlation coefficient. So it's toward the bottom and I wanna look for linear regression t-test and select enter. Now, if you go this option, you don't have to go to catalog and diagnostic on. If you just jump right to the linear regression t-test, it will automatically give R in the output. At this point, you can ignore the rest because we haven't covered hypothesis testing yet and press enter. And it's going to give some pieces of information that um, probably won't make much sense. But if you scroll down, see the down arrow, it means there's more stuff. It will give R in the output. 